Hey everybody, it's Ed. All right, we are looking at a picture that I posted, I believe yesterday, on my channel. And it is, uh, there's me. Uh, it's my brother. That is Pat Chimara from the King's Court. She was the president of the fan club. And this was taken late at night or in the wee early morning. Back in, it was either August or September when they arrived home from seeing Elvis at the Las Vegas Hilton uh, for the summer festival. And they woke us up, my brother and I, and gave us our souvenirs. And hopefully you can see, um, again, this one over here is me on the, uh, well, it's the, I don't know, it, it's reversed, so I'm, I'm a little confused, but... On the right side of the picture, actually, no, if you're looking at it, it would be the left side of the picture. See, that's what I'm saying. But I have the hat. I have the stuffed hound dog. There is a scarf around my neck. There is a scarf around my brother's neck. There is a scarf around Pat's neck. All three scarves were actually Pat's. That's what my mom tells me. She, she didn't get a scarf uh, at these shows. But Pat apparently got three. My mom didn't get her scarves starting until the uh, next year in 73. <laughs> that banner in the background. Now, this was taken at my house. Like I said, it was the wee hours of the morning. And, uh, you know, I, I kind of remember it. I, I, I kind of do remember this. It, the funny thing is, the, the way that the house is decorated with that wallpaper, that red and white pattern, I really don't remember that because it really wasn't much longer I believe after this picture was taken that that was all redone so um, if it wasn't for this picture I would not remember that it looked like that but uh, the bag that my brother's holding the Elvis now bag no we do not have that anymore I had one of those as well I don't know why it's not in the picture maybe I'm holding it in my other hand and it's behind me oh actually no you can see it oh wow there it is okay so I had the Elvis now bag as well those I remember they, they didn't last very long um, the hound dog, I still have. The hat, I still have. And there's one of those gold pins. I don't know if you can see it in the picture. That's around the banner of the hat of my brother's uh, hat and myself. So, uh, out of all that stuff, what survived? What do we still have? Well, I'll tell you what we don't have. Like I said, we don't have the bags anymore with the Elvis Now album cover. And we do not <laughs> have this. That actually went to Pat and Jim, but that's a story for another time. Right, but what do we have? Well, like I said, I, I, I still do have the hat, the Summer Festival. However, it's not in the greatest condition, unfortunately. Because, again, I was three years old. This was 1972, in August or early September. And um, so there's a little piece missing out of it. And also, there's a rip. And this is what it looks like. Now that's normal, you'll see the glue stains because that's what they used to, you know, glue it on. So these, these stains show up. All right, but it was uh, taped. I don't know who did that. I'm assuming my father, but it could be, I don't know. Could be wrong. It still has the little rubber bands on them, although there's really no elasticity to it. I'm surprised that uh, they haven't snapped yet. And there is some coloring from age, all right? But again, we're talking from 1972. So, what are we at? We're all, well, no, yeah, we're at August, September. So, yeah, oh my God, 48 years ago. Crazy. All right. Oh, and here's the, um, the I Love Elvis badge that was around the banner. And actually, there are more of these, but I have them in a separate thing. I didn't want to take them out because the way that they're displayed, there's like a little push pin through them, and it doesn't really hold very well. And if you move it, they're all going to fall. So, um, I figured I'd just show the one that's on the hat. But this one said, I love Elvis. There's a few others. They had Elvis now, Elvis in person. Yeah, so those are the ones that we have here. All right, and then this guy. He's in pretty good shape. He's mostly complete. Well, when I say mostly complete, he is complete. He has everything that he came with. He has the original ribbon. He, uh, you know, it says Elvis on it and Summer Festival on the bottom. He has his original bow. He has his tongue still, has his nose, has both his eyes. The only thing that it is missing is um, the tag. There was a tag here, and that was ripped off. 
but otherwise it's in pretty nice shape a little bit of coloring uh, discoloring from age but I would guess that's to be expected so I believe there were a couple of sizes of these I th well you know I know they had a really big huge one um, let's see actually because this this came from that engagement also so we had this um, I don't know if these were sold or if they were just given away because they were basically promoting the stuffed hound dog. Let's see what it says. I am the world's largest stuffed hound dog. See me and the world's largest bear in the youth hotel. And then, uh, again, I'm reading this backwards, people, so that's why I'm kind of reading it slowly. You can take pictures of your children with me uh, with your camera there you go so when I'm recording this it shows up in reverse it's like a mirror and then this is the back of that so these are the 1972 engagements that were sold out and you can see they have New York New York Buffalo so that was the Coliseum, uh, not the Coliseum, I'm sorry, Madison Square Garden and uh, the Buffalo Show, April 5th, that was used in Elvis on tour. Um, yeah, so there you go. Got the hound dog, got the hat, got the other stuff. Oh, you know what? There was a menu too. I should have dug that out, but we have the menu from the 72 engagement as well from the uh, Vegas Hilton. So that's it. Just figured I'd go back to showing a little bit of the classic stuff. Uh, but don't you worry, we're going to get right back into listening to my tape. I actually may make the uh, next video as soon as I post this one, so look for it. Um, not sure what's next, but we will see. And for those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, I found an old tape uh, from 1976 that would make me six or seven. I, I believe I was seven. Had to have been seven by this point, because my birthday's early in the year, um, you know, within the first four months. So... Um, basically it's me singing Elvis songs and it's terrible and I haven't listened to them since I've recorded them and I've been listening to them while I record myself to get my reaction and then posting them so I've done uh, four so far and I'm gonna just forge ahead and see what's next and get my reaction as uh, it goes so that's the plan and that's all I have I appreciate you watching if you would like you can leave a comment or oh, my Elvis Vega shirt because I felt it was appropriate for this video and that's it so here's the uh, I love Elvis all right everybody good to yourselves good to each other take care